Hey guys, I wanted to go over some target training fundamentals with you here today. Whenever I help out clients, usually we go over target training first thing since it's such a great way to tighten up communication for you and your parrot. Target training is also a wonderful trust building exercise and it also is a great starter to being able to teach your parrot recall training, stationing, and being able to diffuse stressful or aggressive interactions. I actually have a much longer and more in-depth video about target training that I will link here as well as the video description below. Also, if your bird is afraid of sticks or hands, then don't keep pushing this. I'll address this in a different video. This video is not for you and your bird. So today I wanted to go over a few simple tips and tricks that I see beginners miss when practicing target training. First thing is to make sure you have a high reward treat that's broken up enough yes. to where you can do multiple repetitions in two to five minutes. You can use seeds or millet for smaller birds. I like to use safflower seeds or chopped up walnut or pine nut for bogey. Then you want to make sure that you're in a calm, safe environment where your bird can really focus. Try a tabletop or a stable perch that your bird's yeah. super comfortable on. Here I'm just using bogey's cage and later in the video I use my bed frame that also just looks basically like a giant bird perch. Next thing is to make sure you introduce the stick slowly. Birds are naturally pretty beaky and typically will test the stick out right off the bat. Once they touch the stick lightly, that's very important, use a bridge and reward the bird promptly. Make sure you have a good grasp on timing. When the bird touches the stick, use your bridge and make sure to deliver the treat very swiftly. Maybe practice the timing a few times before trying it all out on the bird. I notice that people have a really hard time juggling the bird, the treats, the target stick, and the clicker. Some common mistakes I see are when people introduce the stick too quickly and then they remove the stick too slowly. So introducing the stick too quickly can either scare the bird or it can allow the bird to bite the stick. Removing the stick too slowly can be confusing for the parrot since they most likely already touched the stick. They may continue biting the stick to get a treat. We want a nice, slow, controlled way of introducing and removing the stick. Notice my proximities when giving Bogey the target stick. I keep it far enough away so he has to lean forward to touch the stick. He may even have to touch the stick with his tongue, which is a good thing. I then remove the stick as soon as he touches it. I don't want to reinforce any behavior that might give me trouble later, such as lunging or biting the stick. All right, there you have it, folks. Thank you so much for watching. I implore you all to learn target training, get it down pat with your parrot. It will really help. Like always, if you enjoyed this video, please like, comment, subscribe. We appreciate it so much and looking forward to the next video.